I'm Amy Shannon, and this is Storytelling with Amy Shannon. Um, this is probably going to be my last video um, with the title Storytelling. Um, I guess it's a kind of medium that is very hard to, um, you know, tell stories and whatnot, things like that. Um, and it doesn't seem to be um, very popular at all. Um, so I'm just going to end my storytelling video series uh, with this last video. If you were some of the few that actually did listen, um, thank you for listening to my stories. Um, some were true, uh, most were true, um, and there were thoughts that kind of came out of my head. Um, I am, um, and I've said this on social media before, I've um, put it on posted it on social media before. I have a tremor disorder which affects the use of my hands. So it's not just actually writing with a pen but typing um, and a lot of times I do dictation or I create videos um, to do my daily living. Um, it's progressed a little bit more where I'm dropping more things so I've had to make some allowances for myself um, and I am dealing with that frustration. I hope that with this current crisis that anyone who sees this and anyone who doesn't see this is um, staying healthy, um, staying safe, and abiding by the, the regulations that we've been, you know, have been put upon. Um, if you're one of the many essential workers, I, I want to thank you for your service in any way that you're doing that. And every, um, every form from healthcare workers to first responders to even the people that work at the grocery stores so that we can stock up on our supplies because um, you never know what's going to happen from day one to day two. So um, I just want to thank anyone who's listened. Um, I'm still doing my reviews um, and I'm reading a lot. Um, kind of overcomes the boredom. Um, I get tired a lot, so I take a lot of naps, and I think that the word nap is too, usually means 30 minutes or less, and my so-called naps are a lot longer than that. Um, so I hope that everybody's fine, and I'm still um, involved with the after show with Mackenzie Stewart and Amy Shannon pa podcast. Um, that is on Blog Talk Radio on Friday evenings um, uh, at 6.30 p.m. Um, Eastern Time. Um, that is still very important in my life. I am trying to find ways that I can help those who need it um, in some form or another, even if it's just through my experiences in education. So there may be more videos to come that just aren't going to be storytelling videos. Um, I just think that I probably have a lot of stories in my head, but I also have a lot of um, other things in my head. Um, my goal in life is to one day inspire someone, but also I like to learn as much as I can and then be able to share that with others, and I do. So if I find out information, I share it as best as possible. And this doesn't just go for writers and authors and poets, um, but I help anyone that I can, um, however I, I possibly can. So if you are a writer, you're just starting out, you have any questions, um, you can contact me directly at writeramyshannon at gmail.com. If you Google my name, author Amy Shannon, um, my blog and my book review blog, Amy's Bookshelf Reviews, will show up. I'm on Facebook and Twitter. Once in a great while, I post a photo or something on Instagram. Um, but my main social medias are Facebook and Twitter. And I guess that makes me old, but I am. So um, it's not like I still have my space. <sighs> anyway, um, thanks for listening. And um, you'll be hearing from me soon. It'll just be a different title. Um, sharing some information um, and just kind of some thoughts 
Um, and a personal plug for me, um, recently I just published a, a book of poems, thoughts, and inspirations called All of My Yesterdays, and it's available on Amazon.com. Um, if you're, you know, across the pond, it's also available on other Amazon international sites. Um, and you can buy it through a Kindle or even a paperback. So if you read it and you like it, feel free to put a review. If poetry or weird thoughts and ideas isn't your thing, I have other books on there as well. And since I'm not really writing anything right now because I can't, I am promoting my previous work and I have already scheduled all the books that I have written but have not published yet for publication dates for the next uh, about 14, 15 years. So even if I'm not writing, I still have a lot of stories to share. So thank you for even just listening to this little tidbit. And um, I hope to make contact with you soon. Bye.